What's up guys? K. Mike Moppin here, your Cincinnati real estate agent. And today I am going to discuss something that uh, one of my uh, Facebook friends posted up. Uh, they were actually asking about granny pods. Now, if you haven't heard about what these things are, they're basically like in-law suites um, that are in the backyard of your house. So there's a lot of different varieties of them. There's a lot of different amenities that you can put into them. And uh, the prices vary depending on what you want to put in it. So she was asking me what the pros and the cons were. So uh, here's my quick breakdown. So the pros are definitely the privacy. Um, if you're having a granny pod put in, it's uh, essential that you know your grandmother or grandfather, whoever's going to be living in there, has their own privacy that feels like they're still... An adult you know the second thing is all of the amenities that come with it are definitely definitely beneficial because some of these pods have just about everything that hospitals have so if uh, you don't want to have to pay for uh, someone else in a different location to take care of a loved one it has uh, robotic machines that are able to track vital signs um, it has all of the uh, equipment in place in case of an emergency. It has handrails and floor lights and pretty much everything that you think that you would have inside of a hospital, which is pretty darn cool, all in your backyard. But the main issues with these and what people are starting to run into is zoning. Uh, in order to get something like this approved through the zoning um, commission in whatever county that you're in, uh, contact them and figure out what you actually need to do because it, you're putting a new structure basically in the back of your house. So it's very, very important that you follow the instructions of, the, of uh, zoning in order to not get set back, whether it's timing or having to take something down that wasn't done right. So make sure that gets done correctly the first time. And the last thing is the cost. Now, if you're gonna get a, one of those high-tech granny pods that uh, I was looking at online, it can run up to $125,000, which is a hefty price tag to pay. However, it's hard to price having the ability to stay with a family member as they get older. So those are things to weigh in on. Uh, the final thing I'm gonna mention is uh, sales benefits. If you do plan on selling your house later on, uh, whether it's a benefit or not, uh, I would say that it definitely is a benefit. You're adding usable square footage to uh, a property that you own. Uh, everybody and their mother are going to enjoy this because they're going to have their own little sections inside the inside the lot that they can have their privacy and and do what they what they want to do there too. So uh, I hope this was informative. I hope you guys liked it. Uh, like my Facebook page, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys have a great day and keep in touch. See ya.